The PES is an integrated plume evacuation system for the Harmony EMS column unit. The motor for the system is discreetly located in the ceiling, taking up zero operating room floor space. Its remote location also makes the unit very quiet, minimizing surgeon distraction. The PES control panel is situated on the back of the column. The tubing connection is located on the bottom panel. Rotating the black lever to the right opens the tubing vacuum port where the non-sterile tubing and filters are inserted. Once the tubing is inserted, release the latch to secure the tubing to the unit. This will close the aperture and seal around the tubing connection. The prepackaged all-in-one filter and non-sterile tubing set is easy to use, conveniently packaged and economical. The non-sterile tubing is about 8 feet long so it can be hung on the bottom shelf or even on the side rail of the surgical table with the aid of the bracket for inline filter. The filter canister is comprised of a three-level filtration system including a pre-filter for large particulate matter, a carbon filter, a virgin coconut charcoal filter for eliminating toxic gases and odors, and finally the ULPA filter, ultra-low penetration air filter, that eliminates very small particles down to 0.12 microns. The ULPA filter has a greater than 99.999% efficiency, which is over 30 times more efficient than HEPA filters. The inline filter is a reusable component that has a variable lifespan ranging from approximately 2 to 8 hours depending on the suction flow rate and quantity of smoke evacuated from the surgical site. At the distal end of the inline filter is a red cap. The red cap is removed when connecting the sterile tubing and closed after the sterile tubing is disconnected at the end of the case. Capping the reusable inline filter helps to prevent backflow of air and reduces the potential for cross-contamination. The sterile tubing will be attached at the end of the inline filter. If additional length is required to compensate for boom, table, and or surgical site location, non-sterile tubing could also be attached at this point, although it is typically not necessary. Assuming the existing length and reach is adequate, there are two types of sterile tubing that can be added at this point. One option is 8 feet of 7 eighths inch sterile tubing with a mesh covered wand tip. The wand is positioned close to the surgical site while the mesh tip prevents the accidental suction of material other than the surgical smoke. Another option is 8 feet of 7 eighths inch sterile tubing plus 4 feet of reduced 3 eighths inch tubing which can fit in the cautery pencil holder or cradle supplied by the ESU device manufacturer, not Steris. The variable speed setting is located on the upper portion of the PES panel on the Harmony EMS column. The control can adjust the vacuum flow based on the quantity of smoke from ESU and laser sources. The unique filter timer will adjust the longevity of the inline filter based on speed settings and the duration of use. An optional foot control will permit the flow of suction to be controlled via a foot pedal. This option will allow hands-free operation with intermittent activation of the smoke evacuation. The port for the foot pedal connection will usually be found on the underside of the Harmony EMS unit. For additional instructions, consult your Steris account manager, the operator's manual for the Harmony EMS unit, and the instructions for use guidelines supplied with the disposable components. Thank you for your time and attention.